Let me just start by saying I'm well aware that what I'm about to say is really going to tick off some hockey fans. I understand that. All I ask is that when you realize where I'm going with this, you just hear me out. Then I'll open up the comments and you can have your say. Matt Rempe is sending shockwaves through the NHL. The six foot seven inch, 241 pound Ranger rookie from Calgary has been in the NHL for exactly one week, and everyone across the league is already talking about him. He's had fans on their feet in virtually every game he's played so far. The crowds have gone nuts. He's had players on both benches up on their feet to get a better look, and then it was stick taps all around. Even we in the media have begun tripping over ourselves to talk about the way this kid has been turning heads thanks to his hands. Not for what he can do with a stick in his hands, although he did score his first NHL goal on Saturday. No, it's for what he can do with his fists. He's made the headlines in pretty much every game he's played so far. The Rempy Roadshow, an absolute animal, epic fight of the year, three fights in just five NHL games. 20 minutes and one second of total ice time in his young NHL career and 27 minutes in penalties, almost all of it in fighting majors. And while he did take a roughing call with Jonas Ziegenthaler after a crushing hit on Nathan Bastian, not a single one of his actual fights was spontaneous in response to anything that happened on the ice. No, all three of them were pre-planned staged fights. Last Sunday, Matt Rempe's NHL debut with the New York Rangers. Before the puck even hit the ice, Rempe and Matt Martin's gloves were off and they were going. Rempe trying to make a great first impression after his first call up to the National Hockey League and Martin, an aging 34-year-old fourth-line veteran, trying to hang on to his job. The kid who had 16 fights in two seasons in the American Hockey League recording his first NHL fight before he even recorded a single second of ice time. Rempe held his own, so word spread quickly. A few days later, Rempe and the Rangers in Philadelphia. Flyers tough guy Nicholas Delorier, a 33-year-old vet trying to hang on to his job, challenges the kid during the pregame warm-up. Nine seconds into Rempe's first shift, the gloves come off again. Loads of time for the officials to step in, but they just watch and allow things to play out. Rempe and Delorier ultimately go. This time, Rempe did not do as well against the guy 12 years his senior. No need to replay the fight in its entirety, but I will show you this. Rempe ended up getting thrown down to the ice, and as he fell, his skull came dangerously close to crashing onto the ice. It could have gone so badly, just a couple of inches from a really bad outcome. Word spread of another major tilt. The chatter built. And the legend of the new heavyweight kid on the scene continued to grow. Yesterday, Rangers and Blue Jackets, pregame skate. Another fourth-line veteran trying to battle for more ice time. Matthew Olivier has a chat with the kid in the warm-up, complimenting Rempe on his fighting skills so far. And we all knew what was coming. Rempe's first shift of the game, there was Olivier. The kid challenged the vet. Once again, Rempe did not fare well. Once again, the fight ended when Rempe got thrown down to the ice hard. Once again, he nearly cracked his skull on the hard surface. Left the game, went through concussion protocol, but was thankfully able to return. Another bullet dodged. But you can't help but feel everyone involved in this is now playing with fire. So where does the kid go from here? That's a dream come true. It's just... Uh... Uh, I don't even know where can I describe it. It's, uh, I'm just honored to be here, and I, I want to try to make the most of this opportunity. And Every time I throw on the New York Rangers jersey, I'm, I'm going to give it my all and do everything I can to help the team win. So it's just, uh, I'm happy with how it's going, but just a lot more work to do. I just want to keep building every day. Are you sensing a bit of a pattern? A 21-year-old kid trying to make his mark in the NHL, doing what he thinks will keep him up in the league, while fading veterans are trying to prove they can still contribute and they see the kid as an easy mark. How much longer can this go on? It's true, the kid can make his own decisions, but what's the official's role in all of this? They fully understand staged fights. They can step in and say, not tonight, boys. The league has stepped in in the past. They can do it again now. How about Rempe's head coach? Peter Laviolette can step in and say, kid, I appreciate what you're trying to do, 
but you don't have to do this every single night. Or we can all stand by and look forward to the next stop on the Rempe Roadshow with nervous anticipation. Next up for the league's newest heavyweight, a rematch with the Jackets on Wednesday. Does Rempe have to go with Olivier again to settle the score? Then it's the Leafs on Saturday. Ryan Reeves, 37-year-old, barely clinging to his NHL job. Is he already making plans to have a little conversation with the kid during the pregame warm-up? How much longer does the kid need to keep answering the bell? And how much longer before the kid's luck runs out? Let's not pretend the officials and the coaches don't know exactly what's coming. And I get this has the fans all riled up, anxiously waiting to see what happens next. And that we in the media are already prepping our witty headlines. Rempe has now gone back-to-back games where he came just inches from disaster. Where his head just barely avoided crashing to the ice. How many more times can he dodge that bullet? We all desperately hope that never happens. But if tragedy does strike, please, let's not pretend we didn't see it coming. All right, it's time now to hear from you. What do you think about the way this is all playing out right now? Is this all just great entertainment as a kid tries to make his mark in the NHL? Or is this a heavyweight disaster just waiting to happen?